We're here today at Galatea Fine Art to see the work of Dave Martsoff in a show called Unbridled Imagination. The show took place in January of 2012 and we'll just walk around and take a look at the images. The first one is a last minute apocalyptic education where a man gets ready for the oncoming apocalypse. This piece is called The Bridge. It consists of two eyes, one looking at a modern technological city and the other one looking at the environment and perhaps what's happening to it. In this corner we have Ferris Wheel on the left and Illumination Beyond Ursa Major on the right. In Ferris Wheel we see a young girl growing with images of her and her innocence on top of a Ferris wheel as onlookers are having a summer party and being overlooked by the giant head of Constantine. Illumination Beyond Ursa Major is so named because of the galaxy in the background, which is M81 in the constellation Ursa Major. Here, men and women are depicted in various emotional states, the love of family, fear of the unknown, struggle, and in the center, a young girl entering the world to make what she can. Portents of Genius features two sketches done by the artist in his early life, depicted against a cell wall where the, one of the people is trying to use an ice pick to get his way out of his confinement. As we zoom in closer, you'll see an egg with a chicken hatching, doing the same type of thing. The bricks of his confinement are flying out in all directions. All of the works in Martsov's show are oil on canvas, except for this one piece called Fireworks Man, which is a watercolor. Windows of Allegory features the artist in various stages of his life, from youth at the lower right to middle age, and finally uh, flying off into the unknown on the left. In the center we see the windows with Father Time, whose sigh comes out to the, to the right here, and there's a man lying deep in the ocean. On the left-hand side, we see Marsaw flying off over a hand that's showing you some very interesting depictions of females. This piece is called Nostalgic Confections, and it features a fisherman who's remembering his life. You can see his youth above, dreams of uh, fishing and uh, treasure, his wife and baby, with the dress forming his lips and the rest of the body. The cathedral is one of the major pieces. It features the actual cathedral of Alcabasa in Portugal, and in front of it is a skeleton that shows the similarity between the rib cage and the ribs of the cathedral, uh, as if the cathedral was the um, body of the soul. A woman reaches out to touch, and a smaller skeleton over here points out towards something exploding. Very close you can see a dragonfly, and even closer, you can see perhaps his lunch, three mosquitoes flying above the roof cage. Calypso features a carnival ride from the Canopy Lake Park in Salem, New Hampshire, which is no longer uh, in existence. Uh, in it, instead of people, we have giant heads, and if you look closer, the giant heads have different emotional states. Life is a carnival, and which state do you want to be in, and do you have any control over those states? To the right of this is the largest piece in the show, Surface Tension, features several of Marsov's friends at a summer barbecue, and Marsov has asked them to hold their hands up as though showing uh, an imaginary picture plane in front of the painting. There's a lot of detail here, mother, child, baby, dog, the concept behind the piece was to play with the idea that Clement Greenberg, art critic uh, in the 1950s had, where he espoused that the modern uh, artist was getting rid of the uh, fake or illusionistic space of the masters. And so Marsov plays with this by having a truly illusionistic space, but having the hands on the 
imaginary picture plane at the same time. The last two pieces of the show are Homecoming on the right and Close Shave on the left. Homecoming features two people who are flying in towards a Gaia-type figure who also is a planet. And in Close Shave, one of Marsov's friends is caught early morning in the bathroom. So that's it from Galatea Fine Arts. We hope you enjoyed the show.